Hi, welcome to a brief tutorial on how to access the MAPIT CRT randomization assignment. The investigator, local site investigator, who is unblinded to the patient assignment should log in using their credentials. You will see a screen like this. Simply type in the patient's ID and hit search and their forms will appear. You can see that the patient ID is confirmed in the top right hand side and it identifies that this patient has been enrolled in the study. If the patient has simply been screened but not enrolled, that will be shown here. Now that you know that this patient is indeed enrolled, you can look at the top of the screen. If you see this heart symbol, it means that the patient has been assigned to image-guided therapy or model-guided therapy. To access the model, you simply click this symbol. What you will see is a model appear. Sometimes it may take a couple of seconds to load. The model is initially presented as an opaque, semi-transparent model, and the blue indicates the septal regions along the RV, and the red, the LV regions that are along the free wall. Blue indicates the targets or potential targets for the right ventricular lead, red, the right, uh, sorry, the left ventricular targets. The number one target, or what's called plan A, will be indicated by the circles, one for the right ventricle and one for the left ventricle. You can move the model around simply by touching on the screen and dragging. In order to go into standard fluoroscopic positions, you have these selections in the top right. For example, if I would like to go into an LAO 30 position, I simply click LAO 30. If I would like to go to an REO30 position, I click that. Now, if you want to make further adjustments, you can simply grab and rotate in the direction that's desired. For example, if I wanted to go from LAO30 and then I want to go more LAO, I would simply grab the model and pull it more LAO. If I would like to go more caudal, I would simply grab and lift up to see a more caudal aspect. This is for you to fine tune to the fluoroscopic position you are using. There is one other feature that you can use to change the model appearance, and that is to use the M button. If I click the M, you will see that it will go through a couple of different changes. One is a dot appearance or pixelated appearance, and the next one is a mesh. And then if I click again, it'll go back to the semi-opaque. A lot of people do find that the mesh model appearance, which is two M clicks, presents a very intuitive way to see the model. For example, if I position it now in RAO 30, you'll be able to see very clearly the targets. And if I move to LAO 30. If you find that the targets presented are not uh, achievable based on the coronary venous anatomy, then you are to click plan A and change it to plan B, like this. This will present the second best position for the RV and LV lead positions. If you have any questions at all, please do not hesitate to contact us, and the contact information is available with your local study coordinator. Thank you.